And we're back with another episode of Nefashu's Pokemon Black 2 Bamboo Lock. And look what is happening. Aww, oh, yeah. Paris, you're, you're growing up into... I don't know what gender you might end up being, but we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. We have a Meryl now. So that's our first evolution of the run. And that was literally at the very end of my training, so that could not have been better timed. So that's awesome. Now we have a water type amongst our ranks. Let's see your stats, my friend. Okay, your attack and special attack are still pretty bad, if I'm honest with you. But your defenses are great. Have a look at that. Also, I should probably run you guys through our movesets for some reason. I did not think to teach the shiny new TMs that we had received at the end of episode 4. Until now. Uh, so everyone's level 14. That's what my training was. Just to make sure everyone's up to speed. So Paris learned Bubble Beam. And I taught it Return. Oh, hey, it's still a female. Okay, it's good to know. <laughs> no awkwardness there. Uh, and you know Return and Work Up. Uh, because I thought Work Up was better than Tail Whip. Because at the moment, Paris is kind of a mixed attacker. Weirdly. Uh, and knows Return and Bubble Beam. So Work Up will help both of those things. I thought Oslo return over Scratch, which has immediately made it hit so much better. And we've got Lisbon, who I also taught return. Sense of theme here, guys. Yep, Wellington also knows return, and Wellington also knows work up. So, now I'm done with my training. I have been training on Ordeno, because now we have Shaking Grass, and we can actually do that. So, there you go. That, that's why I'm here at the ranch. But today, we're going to head to Verbank City. We're going to catch ourselves our next team member, hopefully, unless I screw up. <laughs> so we'll see. These children are still around here, but that's fine. Alright, I'm actually recording in the day, because it's a Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Right, so there's also this item that's on the left-hand side down here, and I don't know if I can actually get it yet. Firstly, we're going to heal, uh, and then we're going to go and catch our new Pokemon. Hey, we've got Mr. Metal. Imagine, I've been waiting for you. You're doing terrific. Here's new Metal. Sweet. Thank you. The Evolution Hopeful Metal. And I have another Metal one to give you. Please, just, just take it. A dowsing Beginner? Is that a randomly finding item? What the hell's this one? Superb Locator? For what? I don't know what that... That metal even does. I am confused. But it's cool. Right, we should have enough Pokeballs, but I'm going to go and stock up on items anyway. Because we might have more money for Super Potions. And I'm really getting about paranoid about getting <laughs> rules after each badge that will prohibit me using so many items or getting bankrupt or not be able to use Pokemon Centers. And uh, See, we could have... Let's get one more Super Potion. And how about Pokeballs? Oh, we got 13. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I'll just leave you for now. We'll be fine. Right, so, I don't know if we get this... I'm going to show you guys this item that I can't get yet. Like, you can see there, oh, maybe you have to, like, go on the water or something. Or... Oh, no, we might be able to get it if we just go down here. All right, I'll, I'll catch something in a moment. Hello there. Yo, this is a good deal. Why don't you trade your Pokeball for my Great Ball? Okay, enjoy the great ball. Thanks. Okay, now I've got a, a great move. There's something this guy knows that I, I don't think he's going to tell us. Okay, so it seems like we can go up here and get the item. Eh? Uh, it's barely worth it. Whoa, yeah, that is worth it. It's a silk scarf. Sweet, let's put that on, I think, Wellington. See, I'm, I pamper my guys. I, I might not feed them, but I give them cool clothes. Right, where is the silk stuff? There, 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 there we go. Cool. I should probably give the other guys items, but they don't really have anything. Right, so I know there's two sort of like sections to the complex, so I want to make sure I'm in the right one when I catch the Pokemon. I don't know if it actually makes a difference. Uh, but see, here we've got the outside, and then if you go down a bit... Ah, oh, yeah, we're in a new area, and there's some grass here. Uh, what's down here? A cut tree? Can I lose cut? Yeah, I don't think I can. I forget what HM I got after the first one. Well, that completely goes nowhere. But I'm gonna stay in here and make my capture. Hello there, sir. Hello, trailer. It looks like you've got an energetic Pokemon there with you. Can I ask a favor? Depends what it is. I need to get the workers in this complex fired up. 
How about it? Help that guy out, would you? Ooh, let's let's see if my guy is receptive. I don't want to help, Barry. Really? Nobody wants anything enough anymore. Blah, 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 blah. Fine, I'll say, I'll say yes, because you kind of have to. <laughs> yeah, that's what I like to hear. There are some new workers here in the complex science. In the middle of eating some chicken. Go get those free brains, I'll go. This house has no door. Just thought I'd let you know. Oh, I didn't mean to fight him. I meant to go to the grass first. Oh, well. All right, time for a Pokemon battle. Let's begin. It's very formal of you. I have... Lisbon up in first. I hope you don't have a fire or poison type. Okay, you've got a little pop. That's fine. What level are you? 13. Okay, I'm at good levels then. Everyone's 14. And it seems as though Return does more damage than Vine with. Regardless of same type of attack bonus. That's a bit of a pain. Ooh, okay, that did like 10 damage for some reason. Right. Will we use Return again? Bam! Hopefully it doesn't use Bite. Okay, use bite. Uh, well, we're faster than it, so. Oh, do I want to take that risk? I don't, for some reason. I'm always worried about speed ties. I really shouldn't be, but it's better to, like, you know, be safe and waste one potion than completely mess it up and lose a Pokemon. <laughs> That's just the way I see it. For some reason, I keep thinking, like, Lillipop and has sap sippers a hidden ability? I don't, I don't think it does. Well, at least not in this game. If it does, it's not in this game. You're way too strong. That's why you had to use a potion. Right. How? You know, I'm going to go back and heal, <laughs> even though I just did that, but I'm going to... I guess Lisbon's the best thing to try and catch something, because it has wrap, and wrap doesn't do too much damage. Uh, I've, like, neglected to think about that in terms of catching Pokemon. <laughs> But we'll see. I guess we'll use Rap, although that does do more. And also, I might be able to find Fire types. Obviously, that's not the best for good old Lisbon. Right, so actually, let's rethink this. Uh, so there might also be Electric types there. I'm not sure. I think you get Magby and Elekid there, but I'm, I don't know if it depends on what version you have. Uh, so Lisbon and Paris aren't actually the best choices, really. Um, I suppose it depends on what's there. So, I would use Wellington. You know what, I'm going to use Wellington. I'm just going to bite it, I guess. And hopefully I don't knock it out. We'll see. And it also depends what it is. Like, so, you can get Magnemite here. I don't know that much. And that would be awesome for the upcoming gym. Because it resists poison and all that jazz. Uh, but fire type would also be nice. And I think you can get, like, Growlithe here. So here we go. Hopefully... We'll be catching a Pokemon. Here's our encounter, unless it's something we have already. It's a Magby. Okay, so we've got Fire type. Which is not so bad because the gym leader's Pokemon, the uh, best Pokemon of Whirlipede, which is a bug type. Um, I don't know whether I want to use. Let's use Bite. And see just how much damage it does. Nom. Okay, did about half. Okay, I can't really hit that again. So, let's throw a ball. These things, I don't think are the easiest things to catch. We'll see. My game needs to stop doing that. Oh, well, that's not good. <laughs> Smog. Uh-oh, that poisons me, doesn't it? Um, I'm going to use a Great Ball. And pray that it works. I need a Pokemon that has, like, stat moves like sleepy, sleepy things. I don't know. What? That was a great ball and it didn't even... Oh, oh goodness. Okay. Uh, I'm going to switch to Paris. Our new water type, guys. No longer a puny normal type. Go Paris. Actually, I'm heading to Paris very soon. <laughs> I'm going to be on holiday um, not too long, like next week. So... I am going to do a lot of recording before I do that, so hopefully I have enough content to supplant the several days that I'll be away. We'll see. One, two, three. Yeah, there we go. Well, you're in a great ball. Look at you, Mr. I'm too good for a Pokeball, and also you're a female. It's small, but its body temperature is over 1,100 degrees Fahrenheit. 
I don't believe that. <laughs> Ember's escaped its mouth and knows when it breathes, so should probably not be anywhere near this Pokemon. Okay, let's give this guy a name. For some reason, I actually have a name on hand, and I don't know why. I think I want to call you Beijing. I'll just have a quick check that that is actually the capital of China. Sure it is. I don't know why I keep doubting myself. Right, we have Beijing the Magby now. That's awesome. We are not going to be training this thing this episode, though. So you know, in fact. You know Smog. Which is, uh, Ember will be the useful thing here. Uh, Leer, Smog, Smokescreen. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Stats. Stats, 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 stats. You are lowered in attack. You do have Flame Body. That might be useful. You have increased special attack. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, and then you have really good speed as well. For something your level, anyway. That's cool. Weirdly, we now have a Grass, Water, and Fire type. <laughs> Completely by luck. Um, that's okay. I'm going back in here again. And then we're going to be back. I'm going to train Beijing off camera. So now we can fight Ordino. As I say, which is also very awesome, because they don't seem to do much, and I've been paranoid for the longest time about this no Pokemon Center rule. Uh, we can, as is my understanding, we can use healing people that aren't in Pokemon Centers, but obviously that's just a frustration factor. And my main concern for that rule is not in terms of health, because fighting Ordino, you don't lose health at all, really. And eventually, I think, it comes to a point where they don't actually know any attacking moves. In fact, they know Heal Pulse, which heals you. But my main concern is with Power Points, PP, <laughs> uh, because there's no really easy way to heal those. Oh, well. We've got an X Accuracy. Perhaps not the best of items, but I'll accept it. Right, so that's all it's here. I don't, yeah, again, I don't know what... This area differs from inside, but I would I would just guessing that the inside had better Pokemon. And you know, Maxi is pretty cool. So we'll see. I'll probably bump into something else. Here we go. What is this? Another Magby. Okay, the game really wanted me to get a Magby. And I have Lisbon up in front. Fantastic. Well, you have good speed, so I trust that you'll be able to escape. Good. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I can't even get past there. How do you get down there? We'll find out! In the meantime, let's go up here. This seems very unsafe. Let me just point that out. Like, what's this about? Uh, okay. Suddenly, I've become the master of dexterity. Hello there. I'm happy just to be with my awesome Pokemon. What? A battle? I guess so. You know, I'll play around then. I'll play around. I assume this is a worker because he's Worker Mitchell. And it's a Patriot! At level 12. Just about above the level of these guys. That's precisely where I want to be. And Lisbon evolves in free... Oh my goodness. That's not good. Okay, we need to take this thing out now. <laughs> Otherwise, we are dead. <sighs> okay, patch up no bide round here. That's good to know. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, I was about to have him make a very difficult decision there. And here's Elekid. See, that's an example of me being in set mode. Okay, hopefully Elekid doesn't know Bide. No, it knows Leer though, and it's faster than me. What the heck? I wouldn't mind one of those, but again, I don't know if they're version exclusive. And Elekid is not as good against a gym leader. So that's fine. Now, they're level 18, the gym leader, highest Pokemon, so we kind of want to be around 17. Lisbon is going to be useless, and ah, oh, you jerk. Thankfully, we now have Paris, and the main awesome factor about that is that he is not, or she even, is not a fairy type in this game. So, we don't have to worry about that. If I don't work really hard, my Pokemon won't have a chance to shine. Alright, time to get to work. I'll just continue standing here. <laughs> I'm not sure what I did differently. Okay. Well, this one leveled, so we'll use Oslo now. Eh? Um, and just in case it's a double battle, we'll put Wellington up in the... Oh, God. In second place. Oslo, you need a dark type attack. Uh, okay, we're fine. It's some guy up here. Hello. What up? How is a small child up here? 
I'm going to get a lot stronger so I can impress Roxy. And I'll do that by standing near some generator. Maybe he's trying to fall into it and gain superpowers or something. Okay, so uh, now we know this thing has bide. So I don't really want to attack it whilst it knows bide. Um, so what do we do here? We need to, like, take this thing out straight away. I'm going to use Growl. And if it goes for... Ah, you jerk. I am well aware of how annoying Patrack can be. Right, so I'm going to kind of hope that it goes for Bide. And so we're going to lower its attack in the meantime. And we're going to switch to Wellington, because Wellington is the hardest hitting Pokemon. And it's an expert in defeating its own kin, as we saw in the first gym battle. How will you stop doing that? I know you have Bide, because I know your movesets. Aha! Well, maybe Oslo can take it down, but I don't trust that it can two-hit KO it. I need to... Ah, uh, here we go. See? See? I need something that can two-hit KO it. So I'm just going to keep using Grail. <laughs> until it's quite done with its antics. Okay, so the next turn it will be trying to attack. So here is where we switch to Wellington. You can do it, buddy! Bite is such a worrying attack. I didn't even think about it, to be honest. Just gotta make sure that you've defeated anything immediately, but you have a Silk Scarf, you're normal, and you have Return. You should be fine. Also, if the worst comes to the worst, you have Detect. I didn't even think about that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Whirlington. Whirlington. Ah, it can't be true. That's impossible. No, that's true. I want to get a lot str- My god. It's Groundhog Day or something. So I'm guessing we have to actually drop off here, because this guy's a worker? Maybe? I'm going to keep Oslop in front, just in case. Every day is the same. Oh my god, it is Groundhog Day. I get bored when things don't change, so I don't mind battling you. Hey, I, well, I never said... Uh, okay, we're doing it. <laughs> I guess we're doing this thing. Worker Nathan. With her, oh my goodness. I don't like facing Riolu at all. <laughs> because he might have a fighting attack. But now we have Paris who can take those hits. And even if it does have counter, I have Bubble Beam. So, nah. Endure, get out of here. I'm going to use Charm and Work Up. Because I don't trust myself. It's better to be safe than dead, as they say. Alright, now we use Work Up. Just because when else we can use it? Yeah, that did like nothing. Marrow and Azumaru are known for being pretty defensive. And actually, I won't have Marrow for long because it evolves at level 18, I think. Something like that. Okay, maybe it's using counter now. I knew it! I knew these things do counter. I was not misplaced in thinking that. <laughs> man, bide and counter? These guys are trying to be jerks. Paris has got this, man. I think that's the only special attack I have. Well, now we have Beijing, but... Roll up. I'm gonna use... Charm? It seems to be working so far. I don't believe for one moment I'm faster than this thing. Or maybe I am, I don't know. I guess I am, because it used Tackle. Um, what's the best thing to use in this situation? Bubble Beam, I guess. Ow! Speed tie. I'll get that out of here. What? Now it's hitting, like, for loads. Bubble beam me! Uh, I didn't do as much as I liked. Let's use work up again. This thing's going for something crazy. Okay. Well, if it hits me, I'm probably going to need to heal it off. Because it, we've lowered its attack, but I don't trust it. <laughs> I don't have a lot of trust in my Pokemon. That's something maybe I need to change. They might eventually have to come down to that, but no need to take risks where you don't need them. Ow! Quit it! Right. Let's blow bubbles in its face, which somehow deals enough damage to knock it out. Sweet! Good job, Paris. Speaking of which, it's been quite some time since I last had a Pokemon battle, so I probably shouldn't have done that, should I? It's okay if every day's the same when well, I'm working at this complex. It means there aren't any problems. Well, you're a bit full of yourself, sir. Right, we need to get out of here. I might go back and heal because we might need Lisbon at some point in my life. But we've got two of the workers back on our side. Uh, I don't I, just, I don't know. 
I don't have a lot of faith in my Pokemon today. I don't know why. <laughs> They've done good jobs and they never return now, so they're pretty awesome. But I'm going to go back and heal anyway. I'm going to make the most of whilst we have these Pokemon centers. And apparently we have earned another medal for some unknown reason. But we'll see why. Does he give medals to other people? Does he accost everyone else like this? I don't understand. I didn't agree to this. Or maybe I did, I don't remember. We're doing terrific. Have some more medals. What is this thing? Heavy walker. I'm guessing that's for walking like 5,000 steps or something. And yeah, I imagine I have got that because I walked enough and leveled Paris enough for it to evolve. I was pleasantly surprised it evolved so early. I don't know if I've missed out on anything. But who knows? If spuds coconuts, I wonder what's here. A great ball. Fantastic. Something's around the back. Ah! Oh, great, it's Patron. Get out of there! Get out of there, Oslo! Go! Get out of there! At what point do you stop encountering Patra, anyway? Right. Is this where that other guy was? Oh, we've got, like, dangerous garage here. I guess I could have gone in here. I also don't trust going in there, so that's why I didn't. But we have run away, so that's fine. Heating crude oil separates it into many different components. What is this? GCC chemistry? That's what this distillation tower is for. It's also known as a topper, but I want to call it a distillation tower. You know, sometimes don't you just talk to yourself whilst looking at distillation towers? I know I do it all the time. Oh, my knowledge overflowed, and it was overheard. Okay, is that where you're gonna... Where are you going? Get back in. And we found something. Oh, it's a Growlithe at level 12. That wouldn't have been so bad. I don't know if I would have preferred that. I don't know where you get Firestones from, though. Likelihood is we wouldn't have been able to get it until some ridiculous point in the game. So, you know, Magby's fine. <laughs> Magby's all good. Let's get out of here. And I'm trying to, like, avoid the grass, and by doing that, I'm going into the grass as much as I possibly can, it seems. Oh my, why, you have a Pokedex, don't you? I heard that the newest Pokedex has an amazing function called the Habitat List because some weird girl named Bianca just randomly came up to me and told me. Could you use it to show me what kind of Pokemon live in this complex? Oh, you, you, you don't have the Habitat List for the complex food up yet. I see. Well, be on your way. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not helping you out. Oh, she's a trainer. Sure, I'll be your opponent. Right alongside my trusty Wubat. I wish I had a trusty Wubat. I don't know if I can get Wubat in this game until post-game. <gasps> she has a Wubat! I would never guess that! My god, guys. Actually, Bite is super effective. Should we use Bite or should we just go for the return? I think the return is more worth it. Let's go for a return. Odor Sleuth? Wow, this thing's faster than Wellington. I thought, oh, I suppose I do have decreased speed and all that jazz. Which sucks. Okay. Well, now we can Bite it. Oh, Gus. No one has time for your gust shenanigans. And he's down. Good stuff, Wellington. You're becoming like the pioneer of this team. And I like it. This is one of my favorite places for some bizarre reason. Right, Oslo, you're coming back up in front. And we're going to use Paris alongside you just in case. Because you never know. And I want those guys to have benches. Oh, we can't sit on them. Yeah, I've got to remember that. Right, so last time we went sort of up, so now if we, oh god, if we go down, some guy here, where does scientists go? An item, hello. Ooh, thief. You know, I bet that Oslo could learn thief. Let's see if Oslo can learn thief. Yeah, I'm opening up thief. Let's see if Oslo can learn thief. Oslo can learn thief. And in fact, the, oh no, Beijing can learn thief for some reason. Um, don't I need? Assist seems way too much of a wild card to keep, so I'm going to get rid of it. Well, there you go. Oslo now has a same time attack bonus move. Um, and I don't know. Now I'm going to leave it where it is. Hopefully we'll be nicking some items. Working at this complex was my dream. But now this comes true. I've got everything that I want. What? The foreman said so. Okay, fine. We just have to battle, right? Well, actually, he didn't say that. I don't know where you guys are getting this notion from. Worker Isaac. I have not played Binding of Isaac in a while. Thanks for reminding me, Gav. I need to get back on that. There's a Magby. These things seem to have flame body. 
Or at least, if it's like my one, then it does. Now, what will do more at this point? I can't remember how much damage Thief does in this game. I know they improved it at some point. No, it still has 40 in this game. It is 6th gen where it's improved, but it's okay. We'll just use a turn instead. Go, Oslo! Okay, yeah, that'll do. <laughs> Good job, Oslo! Getting the crit we need at most. Coffin. Those things... I don't think they're self-destruct yet. But I would still like to just get it out of the way as soon as we can. <laughs> Assurance. I think that's a dark type attack, so it won't do too much. The main thing to worry about is just poison from these guys. Understandably, really. I also... Oh, man! Another crit from Oslo! Man, Norway is on form today. Go, Oslo! At level 15. Pursuit? Oh, I literally just taught you a dark attack and you get a better one. Oh, I suppose it's the same. Um, What's the difference? Oh, I mean, that steals item. That deals more damage if they switch out, but when is that going to happen? I'm going to put Pursuit there now, just because it's more PP. Um, um, we can always just teach Thief to it again, if we so desire. Good stuff, Oslo. Is it what it means to face reality? Very poetic of you. I came to this complex, so my Pokemon could accomplish a lot. For some reason, I thought this was the best place to do it. Okay, well, we have assisted all of the workers. Let's use Paris in front. Oslo is out level Wellington. What happened there? <laughs> don't get me wrong. I like that. Um, so, I don't know if we have to keep following that scientist round as well. Or if he just, like, left forever. There's a cut tree there. I'll be back. I wonder if he, like, gives you a TM. I don't know where he went. Maybe he went, like, up there. Or maybe we're just looking around for no reason. Oh, no, he's there. He is there. Okay. I don't know what... I can't remember what this guy gives you. If he gives you something. I'm under the... You know, everyone's so nice in this game. I just have the assumption that every single person is going to give me an item. And if they don't, I get, like... Completely, non-understandably annoyed with them. <laughs> it's like there's no justification for me disliking them for that reason. But, you know... Alright, hopefully you can actually run up... You can't, okay. <laughs> Alright, I'll just bubble beam you then. That's fine, you can do that. Let's go blow bubbles in his face. And hopefully not get poisoned for that. Didn't work out, did it? You can imagine this with one hit. Okay, two hit. That's fine, as well. Gladly, in this game, poison does not linger after battle, which is great. That means that we don't have to worry about one of the primary causes of death in Nuzlocke challenges before this. Well, that was a waste of time. Okay, let's not have you up in front, because you are poisoned. We're going to have... Let's put Lisbon back in front, because Wellington's not so hot on the hill. I'm just going to leave our Pokemon poisoned, because we're nice like that. The smokestack of the complex rise up into the sky. That powerful silhouette is sure breathtaking, isn't it, me? By the way, they're burning up waste gas. Recently, they found all sorts of use for this gas. Oh, you've overheard some of my vast stock of knowledge. It's almost like you just did that. I don't know where this guy's going with this. Hello. <laughs> Those gas holders are sure an expression of harmony, aren't they? There's a reason behind that shape. They look like boobs. A sphere is best for withstanding the tremendous pressure inside. It would be nice if they would draw a Pokemon in these gas holders too. That's just weird. Oh, you overheard some of my breathtaking knowledge. Oh, you actually interested in what I have to say? Well, if I'll be honest, I just want an item from you. I mean, I have a complex buddy. That makes me really happy because my family don't like me and I have no friends. Well, I'll take this with you, Aoife. Well, there you go. I was actually earlier talking about not having enough PP restoring items, and then he goes and gives me one. Oh. I don't know what to think about that. Right, let's talk back to this guy. Oh, you did it, did you? This is a token of my facts. Oh, Rock Smash. Useless in the upcoming gym. The complex is life. <laughs> right, well, let's see what we can learn Rock Smash and if we even need to teach it to anything. I don't know, maybe Lisbon can learn Rock Smash? I don't know what the reason would be. I don't know, Paris can. Beijing can. We're we gonna leave it for now. I think that's enough for the episode. We've got a new Pokemon, and we evolved a Pokemon. 
So now I guess I'm going to be training for the gym. Poison types. So we're going to see how this goes. I'm going to go and heal right here. Maybe there's a medal even. No, no medals this time. So I really have a grand strategy for this gym. Other than not using Lisbon. And that maybe Beijing will be useful for the Whirlipede, but maybe, I don't know, maybe defense-wise, it might not be. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> what the heck was that? Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I just had my lunch. That might be why. <laughs> I'm so hungry these days. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Toodles.